Ahoy, and welcome back to the Crow's Nest, your home for Sea of Thieves. I'm Captain Jay, and today we're taking a look at some hidden locations in-game. This video is a little longer than usual, because we're doing some serious exploration into things in-game the devs have snuck in. It's clearer than ever before, Sea of Thieves has a ton of hidden secrets tucked away in the world that are worth searching for. Usually, when you sail near an outpost or island, you'll get a nice audio and visual cue letting you know what location you're approaching. But here's an example of the complete opposite. Using the map table on board your ship, head over to the junction of KL1415. What you'll come across is a completely uncharted island. No mention of it on the map at all. Anchor your ship and get ready to dive into the water because the real fun lies deep below. Searching the area will reveal multiple shipwrecks complete with the surrounding coral reef. This is such an interesting area that could be the beginning for something much bigger at launch. Whether it'll be tied to the world and lore, or sunken treasure, or something entirely different remains to be seen, but for now it's worth exploring this underwater world. But here's where it gets really, really interesting. If we head back to our ship, and this time jump off the rear, eagle-eyed pirates will notice a deep trench running into the ocean floor. Be sure to have a large amount of air in your lungs because here's where things get fun and really, really interesting. Because when you think about it, the rare devs technically have this huge sandbox, this huge playground to really work with and really build upon. This is just one example of that and it's only the beta. If you swim downwards as far as you can, you'll come across the skeleton of what looks to be a sea serpent. Looking around, you can see we're pretty far down, and we've seen this type of skeleton before. So could this be another clue as to what other creatures we can expect in the world? I hope so. But the thought of these things swimming below the surface also makes me very, very nervous. What do you guys think? A bit more exploration will uncover mysterious archways and columns from a forgotten past. Could these be clues to an ancient civilization that once had a kingdom before being swallowed by the sea? What happened to those individuals? Are these mysterious structures the only surviving memory of them? The thought of all this is very exciting as the rare team seems to be laying the groundwork for some very cool lore in the world. For another uncharted location worth exploring, head to S1516 on your map to uncover a hidden labyrinth. Upon first diving into the water, players can expect to find a massive shipwreck overgrown with coral life, signaling it's been here for some time now. I took a quick glance around the decks of the ship, but didn't see any treasure. But believe it or not, that's not why we're here. If you head to the shore of the uncharted island and make your way to the northern tip, you'll be treated with a pretty cool surprise underwater. Now, it's important that you have a full set of oxygen in your lungs before taking this dive because you'll need it. Look for the mysterious archway and make your way through the opening. What you'll discover is a long, underwater tunnel that leads to a curious find. When you see the fish, you're almost there as you only need to head upwards before you emerge in this super mysterious cave. Now feast your eyes on this hidden cave. Completely uncharted and remote from the rest of the world. Now, something to note in the cave are these floating rocks. I have no idea if we're looking at an unfinished asset in game, but I'm willing to say it is. Looking around the cave, we'll see torches left behind by somebody or something, as well as another ancient stone head. Again, what this could be used for is as good a guess as any. What's important about all of this is the proof that there's much more to this game than meets the eye. It's not just another naval ship battle simulator, but instead a complete pirate world with its own set of secrets and mystery. 
Have you found any other secrets in game so far? I'd love to hear all about them. Let me know in the comments section below. That's all for this video, and thanks for watching everyone. If you enjoyed it, be sure to like it, subscribe to the Crow's Nest, and be sure to hit that bell icon for the latest in Sea of Thieves. As always, I'm Captain J, and until next time, fair winds and following seas.